Hey, it's Elliot, and this is my two-month testosterone update. Um, first of all, it has been two months, and uh, that's wild to me. Um, I think since I started testosterone in the beginning, during the middle of a global pandemic, that's affected by uh, perception of the passage of time. But uh, yeah, that's kind of beside the point. Um, so two months on T as a well, it's Saturday. I took my I take my testosterone on Thursdays. It helps me remember Thursday begins with a T and testosterone begins with a T. Um, so this month I've definitely noticed more changes. You can probably hear my voice is a little lower. Um, that was really exciting. That was. Um, uh, last week I took my, I, I'd felt my voice crack once or twice, like I was on the phone with like a doctor or some, with like a doctor's office or something, and I felt, I was like, did my voice just crack? And then I was like, well maybe I, it did, but I don't, I don't know. And that was definitely the first time it cracked. And then, and then the next day I noticed it crack twice, actually I noticed it crack while I was in session with my therapist. Um, and then I took my seven week, I, I haven't, I didn't put, the, I'm not gonna put the the voice um, update in here. I'm kind of taking those for my own sake. But I took my um, seven weeks video, and I was like, "That is change. Um, that is like a definite, definite change." Um, and so that was that was cool. Um, and because uh, I I've, I was like, I'm pretty sure my voice is getting deeper. I immediately was like, "Oh, I wish I could uh, see people so I could go tell them." Cause like they could hear it if they heard me. Um, so I texted some of my friends and then I was like, I made a TikTok. I was just like, ah, my voice is getting deeper. Uh, and I immediately called my friend Dakota. I was like, Dakota, Dakota, my voice is getting deeper. Um, and then this past week has been cracking a lot, like a lot. Like I'll just, like I work with, especially when I try to talk loudly or like anything high pitched ish but I, I like I was trying to get the kids attention because I work with kids um doing right now it's um emergency child care like relief for um uh essential workers kids um but I'll be talking to them and I can hear my voice go <coughs> um like especially like guys how oh, you can probably hear it like there maybe a little bit but anytime I kind of try to raise my voice or anything like that or just if I'm talking or like anything which is really cool um a little bit like oh no teenage boy i was texting my other friend i was like i'm teenage boy um I, uh, and the other thing is is that um i started growing a little bit of facial hair it's very light like like i've texted some friends who were like you didn't already have a little facial hair i'm like no my dad's like doesn't have that much hair i'm probably not gonna be super hairy because i already like my mom's side of the family has a bit more hair, but then my dad's like is a bit more hairy. But my dad, like, ha and I know I take after him because like my leg hair is already similar. He has like bald patches on his legs, um, so I, I know I'm not going to be the hairiest person. Um, but it's a little bit here. I'm trying to, can you see it? it's a little bit of upper lip facial hair? At first, my sister pointed it out to me, maybe week five. But, um, I couldn't see it, but then I, uh, I posted a picture on my, on my, um, like my personal Instagram, um, of it where you can barely see my, I'm like, I can see my facial hair. Um, <laughs> it's growing in a little, I can, I, it's just really just, it's not very much, like, it's like a shadow of a whisper of a mustache, but it's there. Though, like, I've also been getting more like little acne around my lips which I used to get a lot when I was younger but that was also when I played the tuba and always had a mouthpiece here but I think that might be related but the like general acne has been okay but still already had cystic acne to begin with so um who knows on that front um I'm trying to think the, the, those, those are the those are the two main things that I've that I've become a thing is my voice is getting deeper and I'm starting to grow a little hair and I'm actually kind of surprised that this is happening so soon because I know some people go a really really long time before anything um starts with that so that's cool um I'm trying to think I should have like written this down but it's really 
my voice and my little baby mustache that I've noticed. Um, still kind of greasier. Um, I've gotten used to my different smell. Uh, that kind of was sort of the first thing and I noticed and then I was in a little surprise. I'm like, I've got, now I've gotten used to how I smell. Um, I think I've gained some weight, uh, which isn't necessarily amazing, but you know, whatever. Um, and then on a separate note, I'm having top surgery in two days. So, um, <laughs> that's really exciting, somewhat unrelated to the testosterone, but also cool transition things. I was supposed to have it a year ago, but, um, my health kind of caused some issues. Um, so I'm having it done now. Well, and so, um, that'll be interesting. Um, and now I'm rambling. Yeah. Um, thanks for watching. I'll see you later.